You are watching What's Trending Live from Comic-Con at Nerd HQ, powered by New Tech and TriCaster. Now, our next guests are YouTube stars. They're known for their incredible parodies, and they just hit a huge milestone, 200 million views on YouTube. Please welcome Eric and Lindsay from Reckless Tortuga. <laughs> Thank you. Nice there. to see you. <laughs> Good to see you too. And it's, it's amazing to see how much you've developed over the past four years. Oh yeah. yeah. Right? Could Great. you have imagined that uh, you would get to where you are now? I mean, that's 200 million views. Pretty incredible. No. I mean, it's just been insane. Yeah. We never thought it was going to be that that big, and it just keeps growing, you know. And our fans keep growing, and our views keep growing. It's amazing. It's awesome. Yeah. It seems like there's like no end in sight. Well, we never even intended to even like to have any of this happen. So to keep expanding like this is crazy. Well, yeah, you were in the traditional system. I mean, you're actors and yeah. you'd be yeah. auditioning. So what drew you to starting your own channel on YouTube? Well, what you, what's that? What, Lindsay what started yeah. writing sketch comedy. She yeah. started studying yeah. sketch and writing sketch. And we decided to shoot some with our downtime. And that's pretty much how we started. Yeah. Exactly. And we just thought we put them up on YouTube just for friends and family, and, and then one of them took off, and we're like, well, let's do more. We have a couple fans now, and then like the fans kept growing and growing, and suddenly it was two years later, and we had we could now do it full time. You yeah. know, and that's amazing. Like, so how how have the shows evolved since then? I mean, which ones stuck? Which are the ones that have the super fans? Um, online gamer. Yeah, obviously for that's sure. the biggest one, and then Psycho Girlfriend. Yep. That's it's the, next. the ones basically that that hit and that people that always take us to the next level we keep doing and keep doing and then we but we keep trying out new things and we still have other little shows that we keep going and we do every once in a while because there's like a smaller fan base that loves yeah. it and you made a big announcement today oh yeah we um, yeah. we had a, a project going with Machinima yeah and um, we showed a clip of it and it went over pretty well people seem to like it it's not comedy so what is the project? Let's talk about that. It's called Hell, Michigan. Yep. Mm -hmm. And it's a, what is it, like a sci-fi demon action horror yeah. cool <laughs> web series. <laughs> and right now we just have the pilot. And so we're not sure what's going to happen with it. It's kind of, you know, Machinima funded it for us and they produced it and we shot it. So hopefully we'll put it online soon. Yeah, it hasn't been seen anywhere online in, in its full length. So are you going to be putting it on your YouTube channel? We, don't, we know. don't know. We hope so. Today was the first time ever anyone saw any footage from it. So. And why was yeah. it important for you to deviate from you know the typical comedy stuff that you guys do? It was just kind of like something we want to do. Like we love doing comedy, but we also love like horror and we also love you know drama and all these other genres. And so it was just kind of like let's do something else. Let's try it out. Why not? It's kind of like the next level for us, you know. Now, yeah. Yeah. And how many times have you been at Comic Con? First time. We are First virgin. time you are virgin. Yeah. How does that feel? Feels great. <laughs> yeah, everyone thought it would hurt, but it didn't at all. <laughs> <laughs> but you're nerds. Yeah. I mean, you are. You oh, yeah. represent the gamer on your shows so well, and that's what makes it so hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean, I'm not a typical comic nerd. Like, yeah. I, I've read comic books when I was little, but I haven't been reading comics recently. But it's still amazing just to see this nerd culture I don't know they're let their freak flags fly and it's awesome well why do you think that, why do you think for you the gaming community has really your stuff has struck a chord with them I don't I mean I think it's because I'm I don't know we're gamers so we just kind of yeah. knew what would hit with them you know like we spoke from what was a true place and then they relate to it and so I don't know. And then we didn't even know that we had this huge gamer audience out there. Yeah. We didn't even want to put up on my gamer. So it was just funny that all of a sudden we're like, whoa, there's this huge audience out there. This is amazing. How aggressive is the online gamer? Pretty, pretty aggressive. Extremely aggressive. <laughs> yeah. We've got issues. <laughs> <laughs> can we see some of that here? Can we do an impromptu? I don't know if I can say what he says. Yeah, no, it is, it is very. He's pretty vulgar. He's, he's pretty. sleeping back there? He's pretty. What would the online gamer say about Comic-Con? Um, oh, uh, I think he would is, hate it. Yeah, he would hate it. He'd really? Think it's a bunch of new nerd. Oh yeah, everyone's a new. Oh no, but you know what? He'd love all the titties. Oh yeah, he would love titties. Can I say that on the? All the booth, <laughs> the booth babes. He'd yeah. love those. The booth babes. Uh, so, what does the future hold for for you and the brand on YouTube? Well, currently we have a new series that we're distributing. We have sketches coming out and our project with Machinima that we're working on yeah. and so and we have another project with Machinima too that's actually going to be 
um, an online gamer spinoff. Yeah. And that's going to be another high quality, really high funded thing, which will be comedy. It'll hit the gamers. So that'll be really exciting. So I think doing more stuff like that, more high quality, bigger stuff. Yeah. Now, where do you uh, see the future of the platform? I don't know. It seems to be expanding in cool ways into different genres and, you know, we, we just plan to evolve with it. Yeah. I think there'll be a way where it'll kind of mesh with TV in some way. Yeah. You know, I don't think it'll t ever take over things, but I think everything will kind of come together. All right. And lastly, before we leave you all today, what is your favorite game? Oh, uh, well, what I'm most excited about is Borderlands 2. Okay. That's coming out soon. My favorite game of all time is Halo, and I'm literally about to, like, cry. I'm so excited for the new Halo That's game. That's because you're pregnant. It's true. It's a, very <laughs> <emotional>. <laughs> it's a very emotional time. Well, thank you so much, Lindsay and Eric, for being here today. You can check them out, youtube.com slash Reckless Tortuga. Hilarious videos they have, so definitely check them out. And more to come, I'm sure. Definitely. Yep.